semi-finals match. I am Zen, your main caster for tonight, and with me co-casting is Outlaw. Say hello, Dave. Oh, okay. Right, Dave, you are a big freaking troll. Anyway, uh, while Dave, uh, you know, finds his balls, we'll, uh, Continue the cast. Uh, New Breed versus Horizon will be the match today, and uh, following this cast will be straight after will be uh, EMS semifinals part two between MTF and Hounds. Uh, this uh, this match today will be the mine and uh, New Breed, another team that uh, we casted uh, previously. So is Horizon, uh, both very strong teams. Uh, I think Nubied, uh being uh, the more favoured team here, even though Horizon uh, did, uh, I believe, uh, lose to... Ha I think they lost to Enro Griffins, but uh, um, they played extremely well, and uh, they do have a chance of beating Nubreed here, but uh, Nubreed showing how strong they were on a previous cast uh, against Gravity CF, being extremely strong on defence and offence. So... Uh, Hopefully we'll see a really strong game from the two, and with any luck, Dave will have found his balls by now, and it looks like he has. <laughs> I have, yes. <laughs> and uh, here he is. Say hello, Dave. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, first of all, um, I just played Cole for myself, and uh, we just lost against Horizon. It's a pretty good, a pretty uh, strong team. I mean, uh, I reckon they're all PT, so the communication will be uh, will be really good. I mean, we have an international team, and. I mean, international teams always have a lack of communication, but uh, it seems like Hor Horizon is, uh, is a strong team, and uh, I hope this will uh, be a good match. Yeah, indeed, indeed. Uh, like you said, that language barrier, that being a factor, but it seems with, uh, I believe, Horizon is uh, mostly Portuguese, though, right? So, yeah, um, yeah. And with uh, Newbreed being Swedish, uh, that language barrier really is not a factor today. And uh, we should see some uh, great communication skills here from uh, both teams, which should show through that gameplay. And uh, who do you think is going to come out on top as the uh, top frag today, Dave, for either team? Um, let me think. Well, um, Handley. Handley is uh, one, one of the strongest snipers nowadays in Crossfire, in my opinion. Um, He's al he's also been in my team, so I I know him quite well. Uh, and from the other players, uh, I'm not really sure. Maybe Wien is quite strong as well, but I haven't really seen him play lately, so I'm not sure. What do you think, uh, Will? Oh uh, well, uh, Crane and Ante. Yes, I got it right this time. I <laughs> uh, <laughs> five. Uh, I think Ante and Kryan, they were they were extremely strong uh, the other day against Gravity CF. Uh, they played really well, had some lovely peak shots. Uh, I think it could be either of them. But, you know, Sensei, again, another great player. Goose from Deluxe, okay. uh, from CFNA. He's an extremely good player. Yeah. And uh, Aya from, uh, as well, who I haven't seen that much of, but he did show... Uh, got some uh, great aim, you know, against Gravity, so... Uh, Hopefully you can see that again yeah. against Horizon and uh, I Ices and uh, Cab uh, they did uh, fairly decently and uh, Hanley now saying hello to me hello Hanley and uh, <laughs> um, I think uh, if Rutanando is here though uh, Rutanando will probably uh, top frag for Horizon again uh, as he did in the go for CF Cup uh, I think I think really. It just depends on uh, how people feel on the map, the mine, because sure. this map, it, though it is a rather large map, it's uh, again a very another very tactical map, just like any other S and D map. And um, you know, I think it's a very underplayed map competitively, and I think uh, we may see some uh, new strats and uh, new shots here from both teams and uh, all the players. So uh, yeah, yeah, the teams are definitely like. Like messed. I mean, they both have a great a great sniper, which is Handley for um, Horizon, and it's Wien for a new breed. Um, both the teams are from from one counter, so I, I think it's pretty messed. They have good riflers, both both teams. So, I mean, this will definitely be a great match. Yeah, yeah, and uh, looks like we're getting uh, ready for a ninth round here to decide uh, who plays which side. Uh, Horizon losing out to the knife match against Enro Griffins in the third in the uh, third place spot. 
of uh, go for CF Cup the other day, so uh, I wonder if uh, they can hold their own against Newbreed with Knives. <laughs> no, uh, Knives obviously not being the cho favored choice of either team, you know, not yeah, being true. able to throw it or shoot <laughs> any Knives at all, you know, so Knives being a slash and stab. And uh, we should be ready any second now as the last person from Horizon gets in here. And uh, yeah, I. I uh, may struggle again with the pronunciation of uh, the new breeds, new breeds side uh, players because um, you know Swedish Swedish names not exactly <laughs> my strong suit. So uh, I will attempt to uh, you know do my best with the pronunciation of uh, every player. You know so and looks like Mindway will get in here now and Horizon have all five players in here, uh, but Vision actually. Um, just left, so we need to wait for him to get back in. Um, what do you think of the map itself, Dave? Do you think it's um, do you think it's a very one-sided map, or do you think it's uh, even? Um, yeah, in my opinion, um, it's it's quite even. I mean, uh, as blacklist, I reckon A side is quite easy to take. I mean, B is definitely definitely a very very hard hard uh, side to take, and as well to to hold. So. If if you I think his team should be uh, A orientated. I mean, uh, B is going to be B is going to be tough, especially when um, they're holding middle from from CT area and uh, two on the B side. So I reckon if you just just keep going for A, um, you you could get some uh, some more rounds on the blacklist. In my opinion, what do you think? Yeah, indeed. With uh with this map being a very A orientated map, as you yeah. said, uh. You know, the, again, this is another reason uh, why teams seem to favor A site yeah. uh, more than anything on every map. Uh, just, just seems that B seems to be a lot harder to take than uh, A site on some maps, if not most. Uh, but no, you are right with uh, B site having the height advantage from uh, directly spawning above B site. Yeah, uh, it can be extremely hazardous for BL to actually get into B. Um, but, you know, I think we've seen uh, many teams in the past actually uh, take b site rather well, you know, on uh, the mine uh, in previous leagues and uh, scrims, etc. And, um, you know, I think it's very possible that, you know, Horizon might actually find uh, b site easy to push than A, especially with, uh, you know... A being a favorite of a sniper and that jump in if you don't go through mid uh, to uh, get into down into A long. Uh, if you choose to go through uh, chapel to go towards A site, uh, you're literally in range of that sniper there. And if it's a, a good enough sniper such as Hanley and he was playing on CT, you would more than likely get picked off there. So, um, you know, I think really... I think it's a very E map, but you yeah. know, yeah. It, I think it just depends on the team and the players. Yeah, and how you play it, exactly. Yeah. And uh, looks like we're almost ready to go here with uh, Wedgen uh, just needing to find his ready button. Uh, like how Dave needed to find his balls there for a second. And uh, <laughs> I'm not going to let you live that down, Dave. You muted <laughs> us when you just started the cast, so. <laughs> <laughs> I will bully you for about another five minutes and then I'll stop <laughs> and uh fair enough. <laughs> Alright. And uh looks like we're almost ready to go. Um I'm not even sure if you um have to play the, the, the knife the knife round uh, first. Because I think the the team with the highest seats uh, are allowed to pick a pick a side. Uh, I think yeah. the round is kind of unneeded, but uh, well. Yeah, I, anyway. think, I think both teams probably just want to do it anyway instead. <laughs> you know, just because it's just a bit fun. of fun and just True. almost reminiscent of Counter Strike. So uh, we will we will see the knife round go into effect now as uh, we have Horizon on uh, BL and. Uh, uh, new breed on the T here GR and uh, looks like uh, they're gonna go right into mid Dante there uh, saying hello to ICs with the uh, AS yeah, and saying crying and uh, looks like they're all gonna go for now. Swedgen <laughs> finally decides to join the group 
and uh, oh, and Sensei picking up the headshot knife there. Aya picking up Cab as well. Hanley picking up Aya. Sensei oh. picking up Hanley. A lovely 2k from Mindway on uh, Sensei and Wedge. And Ante gets picked up by Wiki and Crying's all alone now. We're <laughs> <laughs> crying and he's stuck on the door there. And, and Wiki and Mindway will uh, take down Crying uh, to. Uh, Mindway, what a beast. What about that? And, Bees uh, knife right there. Definitely have some experience in the ghost mode. Yeah. Or maybe he just uh, likes knifing everywhere, so you know, it's <laughs> true. You know, it's a uh, personal preference, I think, with the knife. I'm not a favorite of ghost mode, but. Uh... <laughs> uh, All looks right. Like Horizon have chosen uh, GR. CT here, GR, and. Um... New breeds, you know, not not a stranger to be all here. They've got some very strong strats, even though some of them are very basic but very effective. And uh, I'm uh, not sure which side to start on. <laughs> uh, and it yeah, he finally seems decides like, yeah. to join the rest of his team as he uh, may feel uh, they may lose this half for some reason. Uh, and yep, clearly showing how mad he is about getting stuck in the door there in the first ninth round. And uh, looks like we'll uh, get started here. <laughs> so, Will, would you start as uh, GRs first or uh, as Blacklist? What do you, what uh, do you reckon? Is is just? I think I think CT first would probably be a smarter way to go, especially with the. Uh... Especially with uh, how one-sided it feels in terms of defense. Yeah. So I would probably start with CT, but you know, if you've got a strong side for pushing on uh, BL, why not? You know, you can start T side whenever you want. And uh, looks like uh, Kryon and uh, is going to be right next to the smoke there. As the smoke does clear up as Mindway goes to uh, mid there. He may say hello to Kryon in mid there. And I see some Wiki pushing up A long now with the uh, smoke there. But Ante and Wejen are on A side. Hanley now peeking through the doors with the sniper rifle into CT probably. And yeah, he will come through now. And uh, Cab spreading it B long there. Uh, yeah, maybe in case someone tries to push mid, but. Uh... Will be long and air that gets lit up by a grenade, and uh, Wedge will pick up Ices and Crime will pick up Hanley. So, uh, one will go down at A long and mid, and uh, now it's a three versus five situation here for uh, Newbreed. And oh, and Crime picking up Mindway and Cab picking up Crime there. So, it looks like uh, Cab and Weak are trying to even the odds here as Aya does pick, uh, move up to uh, be connect here, and uh, looks like Cab. Okay, and uh, we'll go down. Yep, air will go down there, and now the uh, odds are even as Wiki and Cab uh, will probably regroup with the bomb now. And Ante now trying to push up through uh, a connector or a tunnel, whichever you prefer, and Wedgen staying uh, cautiously on A side as Ante does go back to regroup with him. And uh, Cab and Wiki now deciding to go for a B side, but Ante and Wedgen probably realize this as they do uh, move to the back of A side now. Ante there just watching the B opening just in case. Cab and Wiki are making the move now into uh, B house going through. And Wiki will probably go up the stairs with Cab. Yep, and they're going up. And looks like they're going to get into sight now. Ante probably sees this. And uh, we're in there also. And Sensei is still alive actually. So it is a 3 versus uh, 1 situation now. And uh, Wiki there, Ante. I apologize guys. I could not see uh, Sensei there. <laughs> they're being hidden at the back of the map. Uh... Really wish I could zoom out here, but uh, I can't. And uh, looks like uh, Cabin Hanley will uh, push up to B long now with Wiki. No, Wiki decided to go back now and probably go with ICs. Uh, maybe a little confusion going on here from uh, Horizon, but uh, they probably uh, will stabilize every se any second now, as they do have three in mid, one going A long and one B long. A uh, bomb near towards B, uh, B mid connect. And, uh, yeah, it still seems like a fairly passive play, doesn't it, Dave? Dave. Yeah. <laughs> it still seems like fairly passive play, doesn't true, it, Dave? True, true, true. Wow, Handley gets a nice sniper kill on Wii and right there, so... I mean, this is a battle between between two really good snipers right there, and it seems like Handley did pick up Wii and so... It's 1-0 for Henley right here. <laughs> yeah, as you said, uh, Henley being an extremely good sniper, and 
You know, he's uh, not one to mess with, especially in a mi in a long range position. True. And it seems like their team is all about Henley as well. I mean, he's rotating from from A to middle to 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 B long, so they're taking great advantage of the, the sniper.